is buy my cafe menu. Muscle contractions will be presented today. We will talk about muscle contraction discovery, muscle contraction steps, muscle relaxation steps, quiz game and puzzle. I'm Dr. Biomed, cellular and molecular biologist. Hi everybody, welcome to the Biomed Cafe channel. In this channel, complex biological and medical contents are presented in a simple, classified and summarized form. Muscle contraction discovery, they saw something other didn't see. Wilhelm Kuhne in 1864 showed that myosin is responsible for keeping the tension state in muscle. Lohmann in 1934 found that ATP was likely to be the energy source for contraction. Cross bridges were clearly visualized by Huxley in 1957 by electron microskeletal muscle. A skeletal muscle is the most common type of muscle tissue found in the body. Myocytes Myocytes are highly elongated, multinucleated, non-branching cells, and they are arranged in a parallel manner. Tropomyosin, troponin, and actin make thin filaments. Myosin makes thick filament. Thin filaments and thick filaments make myofilaments. A lot of myofilaments create myofibrils. A lot of myofibrils create muscle fibers or myocytes. And a lot of muscle fibers or myocytes make a skeletal muscle. Sarcomer. Each muscle fiber contains hundreds of organelles called myofibrils. Each myofibril is made up of actin filaments and myosin filaments. Actin filaments, they are thinner and are anchored to a structure called Z lines. Myosin filaments, they are thicker and anchored at their bases at a spot called the M-line. They have cross bridges that can attach to actin filaments. A myofibril is composed of many sarcomeres running along its length. Sarcomere is the functional unit of a striated muscle. The region between two Z-lines is called a sarcomere. Within a sarcomere, myosin filaments overlap the actin filaments. Z-line Z-line defines the boundaries of each sarcomere. M-line It contains a less important third filament called myomesin. M-line is found right in the middle of the Z-lines. A-band the A-band has a higher content of thick myosin filament. It's the area in the center of the sarcomere where thick and thin filaments overlap. It often appears dark. I-band The I-band is the lighter region which contains the Z-line. It's the two regions that contains thin filament or actin. And H-zone Within the A-band is the H-zone. It's the area composed only of the thick filaments or myosin. Muscle contraction characteristics. Contraction model of a skeletal muscle is the sliding filament model. Muscle contraction does not occur without sufficient amount of ATP. Muscle contraction occurs when muscle fibers get shorter. Muscle strength is directly related 
to the amount of myofibrils and sarcomeres within each fiber. The number of skeletal muscle fibers in a given does not change. And the amount of ATP stored in muscle is only sufficient for a few second contraction, so ATP must regenerate. Muscle contraction. Muscle contraction steps. Step 1. Release on neurotransmitter. The neurotransmitter, or acetylcholine, is released at the neuromuscular junction. Step 2. Acetylcholine binding to receptor. Acetylcholine binds to acetylcholine receptors on the sarcolemma. Sarcolemma is plasma membrane of muscle cell. Step 3. Generation of action potential or excitation. Positively charged sodium ions enter and sarcolemma will depolarize. Number 4. A speed of action potential. An action potential is purely to the rest of the membrane which will depolarize, including the T tubules. Step 5. Release of calcium ions. The sarcoplasmic reticulum, or SR, releases stored calcium ions via a calcium-gated voltage channel. Step 6. Active size of thin filaments exposure. Calcium ions bind to troponin C, or TNC, conformational changes in TNI and TNT, which rotates and swings the tropomyosin away from the active sites on the thin filaments and exposing the active sites. Step 7. ATP binding and hydrolysis. ATP binds to a myosin head and forms ADP plus phosphate. Step 8. Cross bridge formation. Cross bridges form when myosin heads binds to active sites of thin filaments. Step 9. Beginning of contraction cycle. Formation of cross bridge causes release of ADP and phosphate. This in turn causes a change in the shape of the myosin head. Step 10. Sarcomer shortening. Sliding movement of the actin. A sliding movement of the actin towards the center of the sarcomer causes the sarcomer shorten. Then we have pulling the ends of the muscle fiber closer together. And the last step, generation of muscle tension. The entire skeletal muscle shortens and produces the tension on the tendons at the either end. Muscle relaxation. Muscle relaxation steps. Step 1. Stopping neurotransmitter release. Releasing of the neurotransmitter or acetylcholine stop in the neuromuscular junction. Step 2. Repolarization of muscle fiber. Positively charged sodium ions do not enter and the muscle fiber will repolarize. Step 3. Moving calcium into the SR. Voltage-gated calcium channels close in the SR and ATP driving pumps will move calcium out of the sarcoplasm back into the SR. Step 4. Breaking of cross bridge. ATP causes the cross bridges to unbind. When a new ATP molecule attaches to the myosin head, the cross bridge between the actin and myosin breaks, returning the myosin head to its unattached position. Step 5. Sarcoma lengthening. The sarcoma lengthens and it causes pulling the ends of the muscle fiber far from each other. And the last step, losing of muscle tension. The entire skeletal muscle loses its tension and relaxes. Key points of muscle contraction. The molecular event of muscle fiber shortening occurs within the fiber sarcomeres. Model of contraction in a skeletal muscle is a sliding filament model. 
Myosin, actin, troponin, and tropomyosin is involved in muscle contraction. And myosin helps in the contraction of a skeletal muscle by interacting with the thin filaments. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel and if you like the contents of this video, please like it. Now it's time to the quiz game. I have put the link to the quiz game in the description of this video. Download it for free and enjoy it. Until the next video, bye!